Average today, so getting back to the 80s. Uh, look at the numbers here all across uh, the five boroughs. Soho, we've got 67. Mill Basin is at 68 degrees. Our temperatures will warm up pretty rapidly here with a good deal of sunshine that we've got, and so we'll push those numbers into the mid 80s. And uh, very, very few clouds making their way in today. Won't get a chance of rain till very late tonight in the pre-dawn hours tomorrow. It'll be a warm start to the work week as well. We're forecasting a high of 84 degrees in New York City today. All the full forecast in just a few minutes. Guys, again, a beautiful Sunday as the sun comes up this morning. Temperatures will warm up fast. We're in the 50s and low 60s right now, but it won't take much time before we add almost 30 degrees in some cases, getting ourselves into the mid 80s. It's going to feel very summer like this afternoon to close out the weekend. We'll talk about our next chances for rain in the active weather seven day forecast. The heat and humidity actually return. We've got uh, this live view this morning and we can see just uh, the dim lights there in the background, 67 uh, degrees and a warm day in front of us. Yesterday was very picturesque as expected. We had 76 degrees for the high. We flipped the numbers this morning to 67. Dew points are starting to creep up and winds will be coming out of the southwest late this afternoon. That'll really push some of the warmth in our direction. Normal high is 78. We're going to beat that today, but the record is 94 set back in 1961. Sunset is at 709 this evening. Out Long Island temperatures are in the upper 60s and low 70s. We have 70 for Norwalk and Connecticut. Danbury has 66. Our temperatures north and west a little cooler. Mid 50s for Poughkeepsie, 61 for Andover, 67 for Newark. So it won't take long for these numbers to get into the 70s and then push the 80s. Uh, we're expecting to end up in the middle 80s late this afternoon. That'll be a warm afternoon and an increase in humidity coming in with that. So that might send you straight to the beaches. If it does, keep in mind that we have a moderate to high rip current risk and so the surf is still being kicked up areas in yellow on the Jersey Shore moderate high rip current risk for the south facing shores of Long Island. Sea and sand forecast west to southwest winds up to 15 miles an hour waves are at five feet so those are a little lower than they were yesterday and then the water temperatures at 74 rip current risk though you need to be on guard because the lifeguards are off the beaches in most cases. I do have a few clouds trying to drift in this morning from the north. We'll say I don't expect as bright of skies because once we get under the influence of that southwest wind, we'll get some of the wildfire smoke back in, sort of turns the sky a little milky um, and uh, of course, affects our air quality as well. Expect that to happen late this afternoon. So it just won't be as blue and bright as it was yesterday. Temperatures uh, tonight, late tonight, will be in the upper 70s in the city, low 70s north and west. Here come the showers, mainly north though. This doesn't look like it's going to be widespread. Next chance for rain is overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning with a hit or miss shower coming through north of the city. Uh, during the day tomorrow, there'll be some clouds around and we could get another round of rain coming in Monday night into Tuesday. 84 is the top temperature. 70 tonight and then tomorrow we'll get even warmer mid 80s that shower chance north and west Acuma the seven day forecast look at the heat coming in our uh, low 80s for Tuesday and Wednesday also Thursday we're still in the 80s definitely keeping things warm Friday and Saturday of next week we could have some showers around but the humidity also up you guys so it's going to feel like summer early next week back to you Okay, here, but not so. We've got some hot weather coming our way, quite frankly. Uh, temperatures go up today. Beautiful live picture looking uh, across the water there. 67 degrees currently in Central Park. And our temperatures are going to uh, maybe get 15 to 20 degrees warmer than they are right now. It's got a really big warm up coming our way. Some areas that are in the 50s will be in the middle uh, 80s by the time the afternoon is up. So it's a quick warm up. We're talking about Poughkeepsie up in the northern counties. They're getting uh, a lot of heat heating from the sun today and a strong southwest wind that could result in some showers overnight tonight. It's 10 degrees. We have 67 right now in Central Park and look at the numbers across the area. It's a quick warm up. 69 already for Bayside, 68 for Melrose. Uh, we've got Midland Beach at 65, a few 50s showing up way in the northern counties. It's uh, it's on <laughs> a hot day ahead of us. Temperatures will go into the mid 80s. Nothing really slowed down this weather. The only real change I think you can look for today with the skies is a little bit of additional cloud coverage and also we could get smoke from some of the wildfires out west dimming the skies so it won't be quite as bright high today of 84 in new york city all the full forecast coming up in just a few minutes tony 
Amy, Numbers thank you. go fast into the 70s, and then we'll end up in the mid-80s above average for this time of year. Hey. Right. Again, stealing the headlines on this big dog <laughs> Sunday, Amy. <laughs> Those rascally cats. <laughs> I can't wait to hear the rest of the story. Thanks, Mike, for the update. We've got a cutie pie. Uh, Baxter sent in by Jerry. Look at that blue sky back there. It's not going to be quite as bright today, but good uh, weather right now for the dog walks out there. And I suspect that Lola, who, by the way, has her own Twitter page, Lola's getting ready to go back to school. That's what I, that's what I gather from those specs, <laughs> perhaps. This is the week. Oh, Teddy and Max aren't showing up. Finally, this morning, you've got Bambi. Give a dog a bone or a big old chicken leg, no matter what their size. We'd love to see Lamar, you. It's a nice start to the day. A little warmer than it's been the last couple of mornings, but we are on our way to temperatures feeling even warmer than the mid-80s because along with these temperatures coming up today, we've also got an increase in humidity. The summer-like feels and the AccuWeather 74 <laughs> numbers go up, up, and away. We were at 76 yesterday. That felt pretty good. 69 right now. We're getting a, a, a warmer start than we did even yesterday, so we're expecting temperatures to overperform. Getting into the middle 80s seems pretty reasonable, and that'll put us above average for this time of year in so, West. And then the AccuWeather the seven-day forecast, these temperatures stay in the low to mid-80s right through the middle of the week. Monday night into Tuesday, there's another chance. Tuesday night into Wednesday, there's another chance. These are brief showers that move through, throughout the area. Thursday's dry, and then we have a low pressure system we're tracking for next weekend. So that'll be Friday and Saturday. I'll keep my eyes on that for you. Um, but for now, that's the Accu Other Seven Day Forecast. Enjoy the day. Back to you, Tony. Thank that you. Makes the ESPN Play of the Day. It did. Adam that Schefter was, already saying mm -hmm. it is the yeah, Play of the Day. It is Absolutely. because it's just <laughs> incredible. Yeah. Uh, you guys, uh, for the big dogs, uh, get your paws up. Look at this cutie pie, Baxter, sent in by Jerry. Blue skies and sunshine yesterday. It was a good-looking day, and it's back to school for Lola. She seems very serious about it. Too. Look at the specs. <laughs> Ready for her close up. We've got Teddy and Max uh, waiting for the storms. It doesn't look like we'll see any rain though until late tonight to early tomorrow morning. And sometimes the turkey bone that you get is just, well, it's as big as your head and it makes your eyes want to pop out according to as long as uh, five hours. Just, uh, it's going to be hot out there today. So prepare for it. Make sure you've got uh, the sunscreen, the shades, the glasses, everything ready to go and dress for warm conditions. You might notice that the skies are a bit muted, not as bright as, as they were yesterday, and that's because the wildfire smoke is definitely influencing our weather, getting caught up in the upper levels of the atmosphere. That turns the skies a little milky, a little murky, but it does not slow down temperatures, which today will be on the warm side. A southwest wind continues to push into the area, so even though the clouds are, are very thin um, and the smoke is making things uh, sort of white, maybe be a day that you want to get to the beach to enjoy the water, but you got to be careful because we have a moderate rip current risk of the Jersey Shore high rip current risk for Long Island and this is the waves that are kicking up once again 5 to 15 miles an hour for the winds but 2 to 5 foot waves that could be trouble and then we've got a high rip current risk in the water